Hello and welcome back to Summo Diecast and welcome back to another Random Restoration Monday. And on this episode we are going to be tackling this 1969 Topper Toys Johnny Lightning Custom Mako Shark. Beautiful little casting, it's all intact, the glass is there, it's a little play worn, but it's uh, going to be a fun little project. So let's go ahead and get it blown apart and let's look at the pieces and parts and see what we got to play with and see what we can do about bringing this stylized Corvette back to life. So uh, everybody, please stay tuned. All right, we got a little Mako Shark all blown apart. Beautiful little casting. Nicely detailed, has an opening hood. So we can see that V8 in there with the uh, injectors on it. Two posts that I've already drilled and tapped for 172 screws, which is always a challenge, but it came out looking pretty well. I did a pretty good job on drilling it. And we got our glass, which like I said, is in remarkably good shape. A lot of times the glass is one of the first things to go on these old toppers. Nice red interior, two seats, and a decent looking steering wheel. No details on the dash. And our metal base. It uh, Johnny Lightning Topper Toys Custom Mako Shark made in USA. So, got a little bit of detailing on it and the wheels, which uh, we will have to uh, see if we can either save these or I've got some, I have, do have some off some other uh, little Johnny Lightnings. We'll see what we can do to uh, recover these or clean them up a little bit at least we may lose the red line that's kind of one of the first things that goes away but anyway well that's all the pieces and parts so let's go ahead and get that casting stripped and get everything cleaned up and we'll get this build going everybody please stay tuned
All right, well, before we get to the reveal, here's a quick look back at where we started. This is a uh, <clears throat> Topper Toys from Johnny Lightning from 1969. It's called the Mako Shark. Beautiful stylized Corvette. So let's go ahead and get to the reveal and see how this little beauty came out. Everybody, stay tuned. All right, we have our 1969 Topper Toys Johnny Lightning Mako Shark all finished up. It, uh, I think it looks so much better in the red, and uh, I decided uh, since nobody else, nobody makes uh, custom wheels for toppers, I would make my own. I came up with four or five designs that I really liked, and I chose the. Uh, I believe it's the Ninja Blades that I put on this one and cleaned it all up, polished it up a little bit, didn't really polish it, just cleaned it up a lot and uh, hit it with that uh, <clears throat> combination of the uh, Krylon stained glass cranberry red over the uh, Rust-Oleum uh, metallic red and uh, it I like the way, well, I like the way it came out. It's a beautiful little car, and it's been sitting here staring at me on the bench for a while, so I thought it was time to get it completed. Well, I hope you like this video. If you do, please give me a thumbs up. If you're not currently a subscriber, please do, and be sure you ring the bell so you'll be notified of future builds when they are available, and be sure you share with your friends. I got more toppers and other items for Random Restoration Mondays. This one's more of a resto mod, but that's okay. Well, uh, be sure you keep coming back and like and give me a comment. I love the comments. I've got some really good ideas on some of the comments lately, and I'll be working on those as we go along. In the meantime, I will see you in the next.